It's a beehive of activities at Dr. Bore College in Lira City where over 220 schools have reported for secondary schools National Ball Games Tool Championship 2022. The week-long tournament is organized by Uganda Secondary School Sports Association in partnership with the Stanbic Bank Uganda and the Ministry of Education and Sports. After getting many medals in athletics especially, but then in Africa, we became number one. But we want to be number one. And we are glad that we are now partnering with a bank that is also number one in Uganda. As a financial institution, because we believe that education is one of those critical sectors for us. This should go a long way in promoting talent and above all, enable us to raise very many more talented athletes in this country. Mogisha says the tournament was organized for holidays to avoid interrupting normal learning. That also when the ministry is licensing private schools, they should not only look at classes and benches and laboratories, they should also look at the sports facilities that the school has. The Commissioner of Physical Education and Sports, Reverend Duncan Mugumia, says the initiative is helping government to identify and develop professionals in sports. We will have strong secondary teams, we will have a strong national team. It's high time Uganda goes to number one every time. Our first lady, senior minister, has always told us we want quality education and sports, and that's what we are fighting to get. 3,900 students have reported to compete for honors in the nine disciplines, which include basketball, woodball, football, netball, dance sports, among others. And now, dance sport uh, has taken very many people by surprise, and the crowds around it are big. And the reason why we had to add it is that it is an Olympic sport. If you have watched our games here, especially dance sport, they don't dance naked. They are actually more covered than when they are playing netball or any other sport. And actually what the minister was, say, minister was saying, and rightly so, it was banning bringing uh, foreigners to school our, uh, to teach our students bad uh, behavior. Winners of this competition will represent Uganda in Arusha in September this year. Eddie Ulwa, UBC News.